I've been sent this great little thing. It's the small rig. Well, you'll see in a second. Uh, it's a small rig thumb grip for the Fujifilm X106. I don't have that, by the way. Wish I did. But I do have the Fuji X105. This comes with the thumb grip and a little release button, shutter release button. But the thing about this in particular, which I'll show you as soon as I open this, is that there's an engraving on the top. Now, that doesn't affect how it works and so on. But it's a nice little touch and it's relatively cheap. This is from Small Rig. Great stuff. Um, I like their gear. I've got a lot of their gear as it happens. Uh, so let's have a look. I'm going to open this up and then put it on my Fuji. Honestly, when you get it, it doesn't look like a great deal, but let's have a look inside here. So we've got the, uh, and it's red, which I love. So we've got the little shutter release uh, extra button there, and we have the thumb grip. And here's the thing. So what we have is a sound wave engraving and the year of Fuji's start, I think 1934 was when they started doing cameras. Can you see that? So I'm going to put this on my Fuji X100V. So let's see how well it fits. Oh, helps to take out the hot shoe cover, I guess. Uh, and this is a silver thumb grip. Let's have a look. That feels great. And in fact, I can still get to the control wheel here, so it doesn't cause any problems. That actually, that gives a nice grip. Your thumb sort of naturally falls there. You can still get to the control wheel. Yep, I like it. Now, the thing about these little uh, shutter release extra buttons that you can get is that you've got to be really careful when you fit them in here. If you screw them in too tight, you can ruin the shutter release. So I'm going to do this very carefully. Maybe you can see, maybe not, but you'll see what it looks like in a second. That feels tight enough for me. And I'll be honest, I think it looks cool. Uh, some people say it makes it easier. There's always traffic when you film. Yeah, go figure. Uh, some people say it gives you a better soft release. I, I quite like the feeling, I'll be honest. But if I'm even more honest, it's just how cool it looks. <laughs> which doesn't do anything for your photos. But, you know, when you're out on the streets, it kind of looks cool. So there we have the thumb rest, which I love. That really does feel nice. Very smooth, good positioning, good ergo ergonomics, fits really well. We've got that really cool design here. Uh, and then the little shutter release button, which, in fact, let me just turn this on. Um, no memory card, but let's have a look just for fun. Focus, yeah. And what I'm doing, I'm just trying to see what that feels like. Yeah, that is a soft shutter release button. It does feel a lot better, I've got to be honest. Yeah, that feels nice. So anyway, if you want to have a look at one of those and pick it up for yourself, you'll see a link in the description. Uh, and let me know if you think it looks cool. Now, I know some people would prefer that to match, so the black. Um, I like it in silver. If you've got one of the silver X100s, whether it's the 5 or the 6 or whatever... Uh, then it would be a better match, of course. And we have that cool little red soft-release shutter button on top as well. So that's from Small Rig, like I say, link in the description. Let me know what you think. You think it looks cool? I do. I love it. 